Contact Denver 7 is getting results for a Lakewood woman fighting with her insurance company. United Healthcare just agreed to cover equipment her husband needs to breathe. In tonight's cost of care, the family tells Denver 7's Jessica Porter never take no for an answer. I'm so glad to see you. I am very, very grateful to Channel 7 for covering the story and to all the doctors at Swedish Medical Center and National Jewish. Charlene Lau has spent the last few weeks on endless calls with United Healthcare. Doctors appealed insurance denials, and Denver 7 made a few calls to United Healthcare as well. I'm thrilled at the prospect of getting my husband home. I am cautious that this machine will work as well as the one that was originally ordered. Gerald Lau has congestive heart failure and respiratory failure. He was on life support and spent the last month in the hospital. Doctors wanted to release him with an AVAPS breathing machine, but insurance denied it. Doctors could not let him go home without it because he would relapse. You have to trust the physicians that you choose to do what's best for you. And the insurance company, the doctor, Dr. Beach, that signed those denials, he's never even met us. United Healthcare claimed Gerald did not have a covered condition and wanted doctors to use the less expensive BiPAP, a device doctors had already tried but landed Gerald back in the ICU. Finally, they came to an agreement. United Health says, quote, in Mr. Lau's case, we approved coverage of a BiPAP machine with AVAPS, a solution that his pulmonologist agreed was appropriate following a discussion about his health needs. Don't let them tell you that there was the only way. It's not. There are other options and and we pay them enough money as insurance companies that they should they should be there for us like they advertise. Family have set up a GoFundMe to help the Lows with their forty thousand dollars in medical bills. The couple who just married last year can't wait to get home and catch up on their favorite team. We've not watched a single Bronco game yet because we always watch them together. Yeah, so they're recorded on our DVR. Jessica Porter, Denver 7.